Now, we present for the treatment using a sponge cast for transfer fractures in nursing home patient. Transfer fractures of long bone in bedridden patient are often the result of trauma induced by the usual transferring maneuver. In non-surgical cases, immobilization is required. However, when using a typical sprint made of hard material leading to a risk of pressure sore, if the patient is immobile or physical status is poor, the medical staff rarely recommends surgical treatment. 17 patients underwent treatment with the sponge cast. Among them, femur fractures are 15 cases. The sponge has a multi-pore structure. It is not heavy and allow ventilation, also passively deformable. The patient was placed in the spine position on a sponge with a width of 60 cm and thickness of 5 cm. After the sponge was cut to enable the broken limb to be wrapped circularly and then fixed with the adhesive elastic bandage. A semicircular opening was made around the anus for hygiene management and applying adult pad outside the sponge. If it was necessary to retain the joint in a fixed position, part of the sponge cast was cut into a wedge shape and fixed to maintain the angle. Shoot motion was improved in 15 cases within an average of 17.3 weeks. A radiologically completely body union was identified in 11 cases, which was confirmed at an average of 20.2 weeks. A 83 years old woman with a transfer fracture in the femur shaft, an 18 weeks radiograph show union of the fracture. A 77 year old woman with a transfer fracture in the femur shaft, a 20 weeks radiograph show the union of the fracture. A 81 year old woman with a transfer fracture in the femur shaft, a 20 weeks radiograph show the union of the fracture. The advantage of the sponge cast are that it does not cause pressure sore, it is light, and it has an excellent immobilization ability. Thanks for your attention.